Hi there, welcome to number one geek. It is I, Saz, and we are back with some more Project Zomboid. Oh yes, more Project Zomboid. Now, just to uh, iterate, you may realise that I'm in a completely different place than when I ended yesterday. Uh, as I explained in the thing, in the in the the words beforehand uh, on the on the thing, as I finished, uh, an update came along, and I found that. I was a bit worried because there have been some serious changes to it and I didn't know if it was going to work with AIZ. So I gave it a bit of a go to make sure that you see if I could break it or not. So as you can see, I've managed to find a carpentry book and get myself up to carpentry three. Done a bit of mechanics, done a bit of electrical and also, as you may have noticed, I have uh, got my maintenance up and my long blunt is also going up quite big because we have... dealt with a lot of zombies I've actually cleared out this section and now I'm moving down further down should I say yes I am responsible for all this mess now, here's an interesting prospect here. We've got some nice um, fencing here, which indicates a military base. But I want Ford Redstone. I want Ford Redstone. But hopefully, we'll see some more some military-based um, creatures. You. Which side are you? You're that side. Now I'm I'm effectively here to increase my skills, which comes with the risk factor. Uh, if I'm not careful, I could get bitten. So I'm going to be 100% careful. Well, as careful as careful could be. I'm not going to take any risks. But I am going to cave in a lot of zombie skulls today. I hope you don't mind. Let's dismantle that two-way radio. Also, I've noticed everything's gone backwards. They've moved all the... Um... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. They seem to have moved all the stuff that's uh, equipped to the bottom. And the stuff that's not equipped to the top. Which is a little disconcerting, if I'm honest. After, you know, after spending all that time. You know, five, six years of having it the one way, and now it's all changed. Okay, can't get in there just yet. Maybe I'll find a key. I suspect there'll be a load of zombies in here. Whoop. That is not indicative of a good time. Maybe I'll just do the other side of the town. Yes, I've been down here too. I'll let them go past and take the one at the back. Oh, you've come to the party now, have you?
Right, I'm getting overloaded. So what I'm going to do first, seeing as uh, give time for the community to uh, disappear. This place is my it's all duct tape, nice. My storage section. Wow, you can see all those dots. I have really called the cavalry here. What I might do is I might deal with the ones on the outside first. Certainly have made things interesting for myself. I'm getting some failures. I think what I might do is I might sit down and rest for a bit. So if I let these guys disperse slightly. is I might check down the bottom here. Now this was the start off house that I had when I first uh, did the AOs, well one of the one of the start off houses should I say. But this is where I started when I did start here. There we go. I thought there might be one here. There's also a crap load of cars around here, if I remember correctly. But, uh... Let's deal with the stragglers first. And just hope that the rest of the, uh... The horde start splitting themselves apart.
I think the outside's probably going to be safer than the inside right now. So I'll do a perimeter walk of the fence. There's another Neki. Hello, love. Would you like to say hello to my crowbar? It's a lovely crowbar. Look, it's almost like the shape of your head, love. Have a bit of that. How about some of that? How about that? And that? And a bit of that? Some more of that? She was a naked writer. Oh, there's quite a few here, actually. I'm hungry again. Now, you'll get to see in a second one of the new things. Let's, let's, uh, let's be sensible about this. this cap guy here. Yep. You can knock their caps off. Not quite knock their socks off yet. But I'm pretty sure that might be in the next update. Should be able to hold these two off. Even with two, it still gets a bit desperate, I must admit. Right, let's see if anybody's got anything of interest, like keys or anything that might uh, be of use. Nope. No, there was one over here, if I remember correctly. I saw... There she is. Another naked. It's getting quite late, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this perimeter and then I'm going to head back up to the lodgings where I have a bed waiting for me. And then we'll do our morning of uh, updating our skills, including the uh, mechanics. So what I'll do is I'll probably drop off there so that you don't end up spending the time watching me do it. Come on. So you got sunglasses on. Is this guy a cool kid? What's he not? Next. Have you picked a number, mate? Slap him in the head. Smack in your head, smack your head, zombie, 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 eh, eh, I smack your head, I smack your he head, see look at that hat come flying off there, 
Actually, I wonder, did I knock his glasses off as well? Could that be the case? No. Oh, was it him or was it this guy? Yes! I did knock his glasses off. <laughs> Ooh. How entertaining. At least doing this perimeter. I should be able to see where all the zombies... I mean, the zombies have basically all been drawn this direction due to the... Uh, simply due to the noise. Oh, right. There's a big group over here. Okay. Um, yes, that's right. You come here. Oh crap! Cheese it like nachos. I'll have to deal with those a bit later, I think. But it's getting late. Gonna head to bed. Snooze away. Now, I was actually having to think about how I was going to do with Fort Redstone. Now, what I aim to do, as, I, as you may... One of the things that you always want to try to do is um, get yourself... Um, What's the bloody stuff called? Hot wiring. Hot wiring a car. Because what I might do is I might actually create, grab a fleet of vehicles and do a kind of like a convoy fleet and um, take the cars down to outside Fort Redstone. So I have like almost like a, a an outside defensive or, or, or storage that I can go back and, and re redo uh, or you know re, re equip re food etc etc so you know got a panel van that will have all the food in it and a, another van that will have the all the weapons in it so that I've got like the storage so that w if I do need to retreat backwards and sort something out it'll work right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to sleep and then I'm going to do um, all the bits and pieces for skills so I uh, it may be a bit of a time jump because I'm going to get that all done off camera because I don't want to bother you. So I'm going to sleep and I'll see you when I am ready to do some more clearing out. And we're back. Um, yep, yeah, so we've done all the cars. Uh, so I think it's going to be one more go with the cars and we should be mechanics too. I haven't really done any electrical but I have done a bit of carpentry. But now, the important matter of dealing with this mass horde that's collected themselves. So it's going to take a little bit of tactical work to get myself in with the Zomblaires. Just walking because I don't want to get exhausted. So what we're going to do first, I think, is maybe attract these zombies around, so that I can split them up. And there you go. There's one now. So 
See if they've improved the pathing on these things. Yep, there you go, the glasses. Next! Yeah, the only danger is, is that I can't see underneath here. And you see? As the zombies uh, seem to disappear into there. It's a nice look, but unfortunately it doesn't quite match out. Oh man, this is a porn star. Look at this porn star Tash and everything. I think he's going to get a different rod though. Not any more around here. I can't seem to hear any. Let's take a wide berth around here and just see if there's any caught in this little alcove down here. Yep. Oh, the big question is, did they break in here? Looks like they did. Oh, that reminds me. Um, a lot of people have been reporting that... Uh, I've been recording in 360p, which isn't the case. I've checked. I'm running 1080p, 60 frames per second. Now, I have looked and watched one of my things on my tablet, and it did stick me on 360p only. And then it improved after a while. So it might just be, might, I say, it might just be the fact that if you're watching this quite early, or if you're watching it on something like a tablet or anything like that, um, YouTube isn't very good at um, making things work. Or it could just be that they hate me and they just want... Sometimes it feels like that, you know. Shame I didn't see any military zombies in. Oh, look, there's. Nice thing is, though. Look what I found over there. Generator Tastic. So there's definitely a positive out of that. We found a generator. Let's get out of shot eye shot. Should have enough time, I think. Oh, 
Unless I do something stupid like that, of course. Cool, cool. Now, I have no real idea as to why it is, but I noticed it happened on my tablet that it was 360p. Yeah, on my computer, it's uh, 1060 when I, I replay it back. I mean, usually I don't tend to replay my stuff back because that's a bit narcissistic. But, obviously, with, with the problems that people have been saying, I have had to have a look. At least it's only fair that I do. Right, have I got a load behind here? Oh, hello. Didn't see you there. Oh, somebody's gone up. Oh, by being my light footed. I wonder, can I hit him through the door? Apparently, I can. Oh, that's that's a that's a development issue, guys. If if any developers are watching it, I can beat them up through the wall. <laughs> I know you can do that, maybe with the uh, stabby weapons. Oh, hello, you. Finally found a military guy. Right, I if this is oh hello. Oh This could hurt. If it doesn't, it should hurt. Ah. They've stopped you from using it now. That's cool. Well, I'm going to have to go around. When I mean, you used to be able to climb. Guess not now. That's fine. But I do want that backpack. Oh god, I want that backpack. Right, I'm getting tired. That's a bit worrying. All I want is the military guy to follow me. But of course not. No, 
I've got three of them after me. That ain't gonna work. Right. You need to sit on the ground. Right, I can hear glass. More glass. Military boy. Oh, how I wanted you so badly. Right, I'm going to take the firefighting pants off. Simply because they're not really stopping anything now. Right, so we've got a military bag now. I can hear zombies. Wait a second, I heard a zombie here. Oh no, it's Bob Ross. I'm going to have to kill Bob Ross, folks. Sorry, Bob. Alright, so that's my long blunt up to two now. Oops, do apologise. So always the habit of knowing that the escape button Brings you relief. Just have a quick look at my uh protection now yeah it's better than the red that was up there because I kept on getting bit in the groin and do you know what I don't like being bit in the groin well a little nibble maybe is that a katana what is stuck in you what are you it's a bread knife. Bloody long bread knife. Look more like a blinky machete that did.
And the question is, will I be able to actually clear this whole area of zombies? like I'm hungry. Let's just eat these chips for the moment. Until I can get everything sorted out. It's getting late, so we may end up doing another round of um, Right, time to make that baseball cap go flying! There we go! I've got some electronics there that I can use. Ah. Let's leave that door open. That's the one tip that I do have for people. If you want to uh, keep a room fairly defensible, uh, and you think this is a place that you want to uh, you want to hang out? Open your doors. It does have its disadvantages, I will grant you, but effectively they're not going to knock them down, which means that you don't have to deal with resealing them again until you can get your main entrance. Because every single door that you have there is prevents them from getting to you. Oh, that's where the door is. I'm getting a bit worried here. Because I saw what happened to Drunk on Life. And he just got hoarded behind the door. I'm not even sure how he's managed to do that. Have a bit of that sunshine. I'm actually thinking about it. Because I suspect... Oh, no. Oh, crap. What the hell happened there? Probably the same thing that happened to him, most likely. Okay, a few anomalies. Um, but, you know, it's what you get for... Uh, what you get for playing uh, modded maps. <clears throat> oh, a hand axe and a lug wrench. That hand axe will come very handy, if you'll excuse the pun. Because I think what I might do is I might actually change over to the hand axe now, just to get that level up. It's 20 hundred hours, so I think what we'll do is we will work our way back. That alarm I found uh, a long time ago is that uh, a, a house alarm or, or a, a burglar alarm uh, seems to be the biggest draw. Uh, I 
you may have seen when I had um, a siren going off doing the uh, controlled burn. And when the siren was going off, I accidentally set an alarm off and they all moved away from the alarm for the, for the, uh, the actual vehicle alarm to the sound alarm. So I think the house alarm <clears throat> is the loudest and it brings a lot, it has a larger distance. As you can see, there's still in the map here, you can see those little red dots there. You can see quite a few of them still hanging around that area, which they must have been drawn from the surrounding area because of the, the alarm. Which is never fun. But what we're going to do is we are going to go have another lie down. Which means that I can also check the time to see how much I need to go on. I mean, I don't mind going long as long as you guys don't mind watching long. And uh, we'll be back once I've got all the bits and pieces done to improve my stats. Good news, everybody! Uh, mechanics and electricals are up. <clears throat> and uh, we are ready to start hot wiring cars, which is good news. Good news for all. But what we're going to do first, I've done a quick swapping over of stuff. I've managed to get the can opener. Let's eat the mac and cheese. Nom, nom, nom. What we'll do is we'll try get this uh, military camp done. Uh, we are going to go a little bit over, but I, I, I hope you guys don't mind that. No. Oh, you may have noticed I now have a police riot helmet on. I ended up seeing a riot helmet thing on, on the uh, way over. And I thought it would be fun to... Um, to wear rather than the uh, fireman's helmet. I'll bring the map down now because I, I am now just hunting zombies to clear out the place. And to get my axe skin up. Obviously. I'm taking down the Undertaker here. Have a look inside here. Oh, this looks like uh, a safe house. Wow, oh, my sprinting has gone up. I wonder if they're upstairs. Hear him, definitely hear him. Ah! Well, if that didn't scare anybody. There's two more over here.
Well, that's interesting. I think we're empty. Ooh. Well, looks like we have a survivor house here. smash this window which will hopefully attract the zombies out well, that's one down at least bugger I did not mean to do that but somehow I've managed to about how many there are in here so how I didn't get taken to the cleaners there I do not know I didn't bleed didn't do nothing This is taking a chance. Why am I? Oh, that'll be why I'm overloaded. I hate this bit. Probably take these two on. Or not. It's a laceration as well, which is worrying. But shouldn't be too bad. As I said, we're going to go a little long today, guys. Only simply on the fact of that there's an opportunity to clean out this whole place. Okay. So I think that's us pretty much done here on this house. Looks like there's only one more house to go. 
that seems to have anything in it and that was the original house that I started off in a while back There's a couple here. There we go. He's probably got another bread knife in him, by the looks of it. Oh no, a hunting knife. Okay, I will take that. Definitely. Actually, I should really add that to my uh, belt. Nice. Okay, well... Effectively, we are done here. Um, I'm going to go off and get these cars ready off camera. And um, <clears throat> and I just want to say uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you like what you like, press the like button. If you dislike what you dislike, press the dislike button. But please pop something down in the comment section to let me know how I can improve my content for you. Because that's what it's all about. Um, if you are stuck on 360p, just give it some time um, and see if uh, that... It, YouTube resolves itself, but I, I guarantee this is 1080p, 60 frames per second. So, uh, I am a little bit confused as to why it goes uh, throughout 360, but I'm, I'm, I'm a victim of uh, the, uh, YouTube's foibles as much as you are. Uh, if you uh, really like it, why don't you press the uh, subscribe button, and if you super like it, press the bell icon, so then you get updated for every time I uh, update the channel. Where has the pink car gone? Oh, that must have been one of the... I've lost two cars. Three cars, maybe? Oh! Whew. For a second then, I thought they were just disappearing on me. But there you go. Okay, thanks guys. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.